All right. We are back. So, we are going to be ripping an entire retail box of 2021-2022 NBA hoops. This is the box that you would see that gets put inside retail stores for you to grab packs out of. So, this is not the hobby version. We have already opened a hobby box of this. And we're going to compare the two. So there we go. There are eight cards in every pack. 24 packs in the box. In the hobby box we opened, there were eight cards per pack. 24 packs in the box. So, on first glance, the only difference would be the one autograph. But, in the hobby version... You can pull numbered parallels of basically every card and every insert in the set. And this, um, I already read this, but I'll share it with you guys. So on here, we're looking for base purple anniversary editions. Um, out of the whole hobby box, we didn't pull an anniversary. I will show you what we got. Base blue explosion, red explosion, uh, numbered from 59 to 15. So, those are going to be numbered parallels. Base Rookies. Uh, purple Anniversary Edition. Base Rookies Blue Explosion, Red Explosion. So, those would be awesome to hit a good rookie in that. Um, Hot Signatures Rookies. You can get parallels of those. Class of 2021 Hollows. Lights, Camera, Action Hollows. Frequent Flyer Hollows. Hitting any of those inserts in a hollow would be cool. My favorite cards that we got out of the hobby box here are one auto, was a great one. Cameron Thomas, who has been playing very, very well. Um, he's in Brooklyn playing with Kevin Durant. He's got a lot of playing time recently because of all the injuries and the James Harden and uh, Kyrie Irving debacle. So... He also won Summer League MVP. He's dropped multiple 30-point games this year. He's hit a couple game winners. Very good player. It's about a $100 card I pulled out of there. Trey Murphy the third, numbered out of 199 And the Silvers are hobby exclusive. We also got one Teal rookie. We got a bunch of Teals, but the only rookie that we hit was the Keon Johnson, who, surprisingly enough, just got traded to Portland. And then we got a Zaire Williams red back short print. So those were the main hits that we got out of the hobby box. Now we did get a ton of rookies. And then I opened a couple retail packs. And I'm only missing 15 rookies and these players right here to complete the entire set. Um, like I said in my last video, I tried to give away a bunch of stuff out of that hobby box. But the person who won the giveaway actually ended up picking baseball so i had to put together a baseball lot for him we will get into these here make sure we got all our packs cool little box there put that right there okay we got one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve one of those felt thick Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. All right, ladies and gentlemen. It's going to take me a minute to get through these, so I'm going to try to go as quickly as possible. Thank you guys for all stopping by and watching. If you guys are new here or you just haven't subbed yet, please do that. It helps out a lot. Jarrett Allen. Kawhi, Kuzma, first insert, Derek Jones Jr., who I believe we released already. I know he's not on the team anymore. And then, oh man, do you get three rookies in every retail pack? Trey Murphy the third, Jason Preston, and Charles Bassey. If that's the case, if you get three rookies in every pack, I'm definitely completing this set. I don't want to go online and buy singles, you know what I mean? So I'm like, I'll just rip another box. Sadoransky, Dortz. We got Jalen Smith. OK. 
Okay. We got a De'Aaron Fox lights camera action. Another insert there. And then we got a Trey Mann, Kisbert, and McBride. Definitely like Trey Mann. He's a good athletic point guard. Not sure if he'll stay at point guard or if he's going to be playing shooting guard. I haven't really been watching the Thunder. Aaron Baines. Chris Middleton. CJ. First purple. We're getting the Shy Gilders Alexander. Now the purples are non numbered. Aldama. Scotty Barnes. And Josh Giddy. Giddy is a very, very good player. Probably my favorite rookie we've pulled thus far. In this little retail box. Man, I don't know what the odds of hitting a numbered parallel are, but I would love to do that. Embiid, Porter, Trey Young, Millsap. That is a sick Allen Iverson NBA Hoops card. I would love to hit a numbered one of those. Or a hollow. The Slam Iverson. That's a beautiful card. The Sixer color on the border. That's a cool one. We got Aaron Wiggins. JT Thor. And Joshua Primo. I do not like these names when they put them in chrome like that. It makes it very difficult to read. The lighting has to be just right. All right. We got Boban. Tyrese Halliburton. Miles Turner. Vucevic. And arriving now. I'd love to hit a numbered card on this retail box. I don't know how that's going to go. That's our first rookie insert of Jalen Green. Isaiah Todd, Butler, and Chris Duarte, who is very good also. Hopefully everybody's doing good out there. I do have the giveaway going on. So guys, make sure you go check out that video. There's two of them you can enter twice. We got Paul George and a Steph Curry Sky View. Zaire Williams, Cameron Thomas, and a Quentin Grimes and a Beeper. Now, like I said before, you can get red backs, but I don't know if you can get those in retail. I, that might be a hobby only thing, but. John Wall, Anthony Edwards, our next purple, Jonas Valanciunas, so striking out on the parallels so far, even the non-numbered ones, Greg Brown the third, and a Cade Cunningham, I think that's our first Cade Cunningham and our first Greg Brown, because Greg Brown's on my Blazers, I would have remembered that. I know we opened a whole hobby box and a bunch of retail and never hit a Cade. He's on that list of players I needed to complete the list. Greg Brown, balling out. Very, very cool. If I can complete the set, I mean, that's pretty cool. I'll hold on to that. I'll put it away in a box and just keep it. I like completing sets. So we got a James Harden. Gary. Scary Gary. La Mello. Pure Drip players. Those are sick cards. Very cool. Franz Wagner and Suggs. Hopefully everybody's doing good out there, guys. This is a fun little retail box rip. Just trying to do something a little different. that I, I haven't seen a single one of these get opened on YouTube. So, We 
We got lights, camera, action, AD. And we got Kaya Jones, Keon Johnson, and Luca Garza. Still nothing good yet. Just base rookies. Another AD. Skyview. Robinson, Edwards, and David Johnson are the rookies in that pack. Now, the one thing I will pass on to you guys is when I opened the hobby box, you only get one rookie per hobby pack. And because of that, you end up only getting 24 rookies in a box. Now, you do get rookie inserts mixed in there and things like that. But base rookies, you're only going to get 24 in a box. Another purple here, Ricky Rubio. So we're striking out on the non-numbered parallels. Jonathan Kaminga, who is probably in my top three of favorite rookies out of this class. Definitely a very, very talented player. Springer and Josh Christopher. So... A half a retail box, you're going to get more rookies than you are in an entire hobby box, which is strange, but that's just how it is. Depends on what you're targeting. So take that knowledge with a grain of salt. Nicholas Batum, what do we got here coming up next? Thomas Bryant. And a Dwayne Wade Slam. I know there's numbered inserts of these. That would be so sick to hit one of those, man. I see that border and every time it gets me because it's like, oh. There we go. Evan Mobley, who's definitely front runner right now for rookie of the year. He's playing like the like what David Robinson played like when he was a rookie, you know? Got Scotty Lewis and Moses Moody. Alright. We are at the halfway point, plugging through here. Let's heat up. Come on, guys. Let's get that energy going. Yes. Okay. See? I just had to get in the right mindset. Pull the heat. So we got a rookie, finally, in our purple. Ayo Dasunma. For the Bulls. I don't care if I can't pronounce his name. A rookie purple. Another Greg Brown. Does that... Okay, well, this will tell us right now if there's a correlation like there is in baseball, if there is a Cade Cunningham behind this. What do you know? Same coalition. I will take it. That's why I didn't hit one in all those, because it's either you get him or you don't. Just like in baseball, it's not random, it's a collation. So, good to know. Definitely good to know. It was the same thing with the Chronicles uh, hangers that I opened last night. I went through my inserts and my uh, exclusive cards that I got in there, and all of them, it was just the same pattern. God, why can't I get a LeBron? Why do I keep getting these damn Anthony Davis cards? I'm not a fan of Anthony Davis, but... France, Jalen Suggs, Kaya Jones. See, now we're starting to get doubles. That's unfortunate, but... Let's get it. Come on. Still looking for a numbered card, an auto. You're not guaranteed an auto in a retail box. That's the thing. But... If we do hit one, that would be incredible. James Harden, the beard. That beard is weird. Man, another Cade Cunningham? I went from opening a full hobby box and a bunch of retail packs and not getting a single Cade. And now I've hit three. Three in this first little retail box. And he's always behind him. And then we got De'Aaron Sharp. I'll take it, man, because I didn't have any of him. I had like four Evan Mobleys, 
It just depends on what box you guys get. Jalen Brown. There's a LeBron. Here comes another purple. Not a rookie. Mitchell Robinson. We got Cameron Thomas. There we go. To match our auto. I didn't have his base. He was on the list. All I had was his auto, which I couldn't count as part of the set. Grimes and Greg Brown the third. See, Cade was supposed to be behind him. That's why he was in the pack before. It's that coalition, man. At least we're getting good rookies. Hopefully, if we're doubling up on rookies, we'll get another Mobley, too. Chris Stapps, Porzingis. Yeah. Nikola Jokic. And no insert in this pack. Oh, I think it's stuck to the card in front of it. It's an insert. Paul George. All right, we got Jared Butler, Chris Duarte, and Zaire Williams. I will flip over the cards at the end and check. I don't think you can get, actually, those red backs now that I'm thinking about it in retail. But come on, man. Last stack. Can we get hot? We're looking for a numbered card. If you buy an entire box, man, you need to be able to pull a numbered there's a Josh Christopher, class of 2021. You need to be able to pull at least one parallel that's numbered or an auto. Plain and simple, especially in a low-tier product like this. JT Thor, Primo, and Isaiah Todd. I mean, the amount of rookies that we're getting is crazy. These are all rookies only, base rookies. So... I mean, you're going to get a ton. You're going to get a ton of base rookies. But we're looking for the bangers. Pascal. Onyeka Okongu. <laughs> What's here? Well, that's the third one of those that we've pulled. I have two of those that I pulled in my hobby box. Scotty Barnes. Josh Giddy, Aaron Wiggins. Starting to double up on the rookies now. We got one, two, three, four, and five packs left. Can we heat up? Is there an auto or a numbered parallel at the bottom of this box? We're hitting the bottom left corner, which in the last couple hobby boxes I opened, baseball and everything, that's where my hits were. Joe Ingles, come on! Uh, man, we're not getting very lucky with these non-numbered parallels. Kisbert, Miles McBride, and Aldama. Again, thank you guys for watching. This last week, I finally hit the 200 subscriber mark. You guys are incredible. I appreciate all of you guys. Make sure you enter that giveaway so if you've supported me this far that you got a chance to win something. Eric Bledsoe. There's a LeBron. Insert the drip. Still haven't hit a hollow yet either, man. That's crazy. Not even a base hollow. Last three. Come on. You would hope there would be an auto or something in one of these retail boxes that's why i bought it i was like man instead of just trying to get lucky with a pack let's just get the whole box lonzo man now we're getting the inserts that we got last time in our other retail boxes larry johnson slam so we got Jaden springer josh christopher and another evan mobley It's not looking good, guys. Two packs left. It's got to happen now. Give it to us. Come on. Bobby Portis. Come on. Oh, 
LeBron insert. Keon Johnson, Luca Garza, Robinson, and a beeper. Last pack in the box. Hail Mary. Ah, oh, it's going to be an insert. Paul George. Scotty Lewis. Moses Moody. Well, it is what it is. Nothing crazy. Got lots of inserts and tons of base rookies. Hopefully, I'll be able to complete the set now. I'm going to flip through the backs just to make sure there's no sh red back short prints. Because that would be a much bigger hit. Like, let's say one of those Cades is like a red back or something, you know? But, so far, no. No. They kind of just sneak up on you. No. No. Well, I don't think any of the inserts can be like that, but yeah. These are just the team colors. Well, it was a fun rip. We got tons of non numbered <laughs> inserts. We did get one rookie there in purple, but that's it, man. Not a great box. We did get lots of good base rookies, but, you know, it is what it is, guys. Sometimes you win, sometimes you lose. The hobby box was definitely better than the retail box. So, now, that doesn't mean that there's not going to be good retail boxes out there. But, if you're looking for parallels, numbered cards, short prints, autographs, I would say the hobby box is definitely the way to go. I think I paid 160 for my hobby box, and I mean, that's pretty reasonable. Um, I think they were charging $4 a pack. I mean, it's you're going to end up paying around 100 bucks if you buy the retail box, so I would rather spend that little bit extra to get the hobby. So, yeah, much love, everybody. Make sure you guys go check out that video. Oh, I did look up. In my last video, I opened those Chronicles hangers, and I pulled this auto in the first one. I looked him up. This is a red parallel apprentice auto, O'Shea Brissett. So he is playing for the Pacers. He's from the Canadian Basketball League, and he's getting pretty solid playing time. So um, he's a decent guy, you know. Nobody I had ever heard of, really, because I don't listen to uh, Pacers basketball stuff. But, yeah, and the Blazers don't play them very often. So, much love, everybody. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure you enter the giveaway. We're going to be ripping lots of more stuff. I've been looking for more top Series 1. But every time I hit up the stores, man, they just haven't been stocking it. Or I think there's something weird going on in my area where people are starting to... Uh, get tipped off when stuff is delivered because I live right next door to a Walmart, a Freddy's, a Target, and I literally, I go there every morning, every afternoon, and every night trying to find stuff. And uh, plus all the hobby stuff I get, I get from a local guy here who owns his own little card shop, and me and him have worked out some pretty cool stuff. So it's been getting harder and harder to find stuff again especially since Walmart took their limits off. I've been trying to catch Walmart the most because my target has a five per person limit. Now, when it comes to the top series one, you already know. If I find a bunch of hangers, I'm buying all of them if they're at Walmart because there's no limit. I'll buy 30 if I can. I'll buy a whole box, a case if I can. I'm looking for retail flagship because in my experience, it is way better way better ripping flagship in retail than than hobby now you can get mega hits in jumbo dude but it's so expensive and so rare 
your odds of that happening are not great. You can buy 30 hanger boxes for the price of one jumbo. So I recommend doing that instead. But much love, everybody. Please stay safe out there. Have fun ripping cards. We've gotten lots of cool stuff. Just looking up here, it's crazy, man. Some of these cards I've pulled and gotten recently. It's just unbelievable, man. Picking up that flawless, getting this yesterday. The one of one super fractor auto, Bobby Dalbeck. The Vlad rookie auto. We got CJ. We got Anthony. The Dame Dalla. Hopefully, Dame's going to come back healthy. We'll see what happens, but I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace.